Thank you so much, Ronald. As I said this morning, it's a great pleasure to be here. Thank you to the organizers for inviting me. So I'm going to talk about these iterated local search applications and uh, extensions. So this is a little bit the outline of the talk. So I will explain what is iterated local search. So I will start very like uh, basics and then I will, at the end, I will talk about the more advanced things. Uh, the applications, as I will not differentiate, so I, when I explain a technique, I will explain uh, uh, applications, like, like uh, so we will not be separated. So I will talk about hybrid, uh, iterative local search with other metaheuristics, similar alias, two-stage optimization problems, and MAT, ELS, and also multi-objective um, alias. So I will... I start. I work in combinatorial optimization, as uh, Ronald said. So my interest is going all combinatorial optimization problems, so problems that we have to select a subset of a set of elements and find the best subset of this uh, uh, all subsets. So it's a very uh, uh, exponential uh, dimension of the solutions. And I work mostly in routing, scheduling, location problems. This is our problems that appears in many industries. So I work a lot in retailing. So while the VRP, the vehicle routing problem, is the most well known, the, like also the location for, for stores, for warehouses, I also work on transportation. And recently I've started working in healthcare and some problems in healthcare, mostly logistics healthcare. So, that, so there's a lot of applications on community optimizations out there that we need to solve. To do this, I try usually solve using a metaheuristic. So the iterated local search I will present today is a metaheuristic. Because a metaheuristic here, there is a definition done by Celso Ribeiro, which is uh, so a process to try to, at each step, find, you apply a, a neuristic to find good solutions for a specific problem. And each problem, we have to define a metaheuristic. So we have a, a certain parts which are general, but some parts are personalized for the problem we, are, we want to solve. Okay? How do I measure which, how good is a metaheuristics? We, usually, we measure how good is a metaheuristics or an algorithm by the accuracy, how close is to the optimal. Can we find the optimal? Great. If we cannot find the optimal, how close is the optimal? But I also need some other three aspects that I was measured in this work that I think it's very interesting. Speed, I need a lot of speed, so how fast is this, is this algorithm? Also simplicity, how simple it is, so more simple, better. And also how flexible is this metaheuristic? So if the problem 